There is one organ which causes high blood pressure, and it's not what you think. And there are specific exercises you can use to target and fix your blood pressure easily. No diet, lifestyle changes, or medication required. Check the link in the description below, but for now, today's question. The solution is to be adequately treated with an optimal thyroid medication especially natural desiccated thyroid like Nature Thyroid, Canada's thyroid by IRFA, NP Thyroid, Thyroid S, or other NDT meds. Options for desiccated thyroid brands are here and ingredients are listed here. Even adding synthetic T3 to your T4 is a far better treatment. Source Video Blood Pressure Exercises vs LCB You will then dose according to the elimination of symptoms, not the TSH. Patients have learned a great deal on adequate thyroid treatment over the past few years. No more nosebleeds which I had been having regularly before, and the fluid retention just melted away. Now the tissue damage took longer to heal, and my legs hurt for almost a year after the swelling went away, but heal they did and now I have no signs of the horrible heart condition or hypertension I once had. Yes, there can be in some. Aldosterone is a steroid produced by your adrenals, and if you end up with high aldosterone, BP can go up. This can happen with chronic stress. Conversely, if your aldosterone falls, which happens to a lot of patients with low cortisol, BP can go down. The diastolic, the bottom number, can often be affected by your aldosterone. Have you benefited from STTM? Please donate to the hosting fee. Though the minimum you will see is far below what we pay monthly, it will be appreciated. Have you benefited from STTM? If so, you can donate to the hosting fee. It's gotten huge due to all the info on here. Note that the minimum fee is far, far below what we have to pay every month. But if that's all you can afford, it's very appreciated. Feeling panicked or frustrated by the shortages of two particular brands of natural desiccated thyroid? Let's take a look at all of this and what you can do. Brands of NDT Nature Thyroid and WP Thyroid are two brands of NDT produced by Hypothyroidism in its initial stages may not alter the blood pressure much. In fact it will reduce most of the physiological processes. The cardiac output, reduce BMR, reduce heart rate, reduce respiratory rate etc. But uncontrolled hypothyroidism can cause substantial increase in weight. More in the frontal obesity category. This puts a lot of pressure over portal circulation which can cause increase in BP over a long run. Hypothyroidism can cause atherosclerosis which can again contribute to the blood pressure. Hypothyroidism causes increase in fluid retention, increase in blood volume, increase in blood pressure. Hypothyroidism can cause increase in LDL again a cause for blood pressure. Therefore uncontrolled hypothyroidism can cause significant susceptibility to hypertension. I am not a doctor, but from general knowledge. The thyroid gland plays an important part in controlling blood pressure. The production of hormone by the thyroid gland controls the heartbeat and hence the thyroid can increase slash decrease the overall blood pressure that is both systolic and diastolic. Recent findings suggest that hypothyroidism, reduction in the production of thyroid hormone, can elevate one of the BP parameters systolic pressure by hardener the arteries over a period of time. This is especially noticed in elderly people. Hence regular testing of the thyroid function is very important. From Medscape Login The majority of the studies in the literature reported a high prevalence of hypertension in hypothyroidism. Mechanisms for the pathogenesis of hypertension and hypothyroidism include increases in peripheral vascular resistance and arterial stiffness. Vasoconstriction may reflect the absence of demonstrated vasodilatory T3 effects on vascular smooth muscle cells or may be the result of a higher circulating noradrenaline level and increased AT1 with decreased number of vascular AT2 receptors. Hypothyroid hypertensive patients display low plasma renin activity. Low angiotensin levels and increase vasopressin plasma levels. On the other hand, thyroid hormone deficiency is associated with a reduction of the GFR and renal blood flow, inducing lower BP values. 